So there are two different types of pad placements for the calf. On the right side, we can see the wireless setup. The wired setup here would be exactly the same. We have a two by four or the longer pad across the top of the calf. And then we have two two by twos or the smaller pad at the bottom of the calf. For the wireless, you just take one electrode and span the length of the calf muscle. So you have the top at the top of the calf, the bottom at the bottom of the calf towards the ankle, and you'll repeat that on both sides. Sometimes, however, because we have four leads, people want to do one entire side of their body at the same time, and you can do this. In this case, the calf setup would look like this. You would take one two by two and put it at the top of the calf. You would take your blue lead, the first lead, for example, and the black end of that lead would go at the top of the calf, and the red end of that lead would go at the bottom of the calf. In this way, you could also perhaps do your hamstring simultaneously. We also have a two by two at the top of the hamstring and a two by two at the bottom of the hamstring. So we could attach a black lead to the top and a red lead to the bottom. And in this way, an athlete could treat their hamstring and their calf in the same manner. This setup is also very good for people with very small calves, where the two by four may just span too large of a distance and you start getting into some of the perineal um, or tibialis muscles. So two different setups, two by four with two two by twos at the bottom, or one two by two at the top, and one two by two at the bottom, which also allows you to treat um, another muscle group on that same side of the body.